So Ghostbusters is back in the limelight with a new movie coming out, and it doesn't look all that great. A lot of people are saying if you don't like it that you hate women, I just think you hate bad jokes and bad special effects. However, I'll still check out the movie because it looks interesting to me. Now Ghostbusters was a big part of my childhood, I loved the first two movies and the subsequent cartoon as well. So the Ghostbusters video game line always appealed to me, yes some were better than others, but to me there was one game that stood out amongst the rest, and there's one Ghostbusters game that I feel is the best Ghostbusters game. Now in 2009 Activision brought Ghostbusters back into the limelight with a new video game that featured original voice actors and a whole new plot, and a lot of people consider this to be the third Ghostbusters movie, especially when you had people like Bill Murray involved with the situation. Now a version was released on the PS3 and the Xbox 360, and that was called the realistic version, and a lot of people loved that version. I liked it, I didn't love it. To me, the Wii version was actually the best version. So let's talk about Ghostbusters for the Wii, and why I think it's the best Ghostbusters game ever. So Ghostbusters the game is considered by many to be the third Ghostbusters movie. It was written by Harold Ramis and Dan Aykroyd, and it features Ernie Hudson and Bill Murray reprising their roles in voice acting. And all of it's really good, the script is solid, it feels more like a movie than a video game script, there's constant chatter between the characters, and it's just so well done. You play as a new recruit who gets to hang out with the original Ghostbusters and help them bust ghosts. You're visiting old locations, you're visiting new locations, Everything feels really familiar, but new and fresh, and that was a real advantage for this game because it really could attract new Ghostbusters fans and the classic ones into it. Now, like I said, the script was just top notch. There's jokes, there's constant dialogue between the characters, and it really makes the game feel alive. Whereas, you know, some of these games nowadays, there's not enough chatter between the characters. There's no real emotional connection, but in Ghostbusters, it feels like you're one of the Ghostbusters. Gotcha. He appears to be after something specific. Or someone. Why are you looking at me? Well, you look a lot better than I was really. Now one of the big things about the Wii version of the game was of course the graphics. The PS3 and the Xbox 360 went with a darker style, a grittier style, that was kind of popular at the time in 2009. And while I understand why they went with this realistic style, I just don't prefer it to the Wii version. You see, it's so dark and gritty and lacking color, it looks more like a Gears of War game than a Ghostbusters game. Whereas the Wii version is bright and colorful and animated, and you can see expressions in the characters' faces, and it just feels more alive to me. I did appreciate the PS3 and the Xbox 360 version, but I just didn't think it did as good of a job conveying the Ghostbusters image as this version did with the Wii. Now, of course, one of the big drawbacks of the Wii to many people was the motion controls, but in this game, it's fantastic. It feels like you're using the proton pack. It feels like you're using the proton beam to raggle up these ghosts as you're destroying these huge areas and breaking everything in sight and getting these ghosts to be captured. And it just adds so much to the game. It really just immerses you in the game. It makes you feel like you're part of the Ghostbusters universe. And that's an experience that can't be experienced on any other console. Yes, they had a PS2 version of the game that uses the same graphical style, but it had no motion controls. And we've already talked about the grittier look of the PS3 and the Xbox 360 version, but with the lack of motion controls, I really think the Wii takes the cake on this. The Wii version just feels so complete. Everything is just top notch, and I just love it to death. Even if you've played the PS3 or the Xbox 360 version, you really should check out the Wii version solely because of the motion controls, if anything else, because it adds so much. It adds a whole new dimension to the game, and it's just so great. I love it. I love Ghostbusters on the Wii. It's one of my favorite Wii titles ever because it's just so good, and it reminds me of my childhood, but it still adds something new and fresh, and because of that, I really enjoy it. And plus, the Stay Puft fight is just freaking awesome. So let me know in the comments what you think if you've played Ghostbusters on the Wii or if you only played it on the PS3 or the Xbox 360. It's so cheap on the Wii. If you own a Wii or a Wii U, you need to pick it up. And also in the comments, let me know if you're going to go see the next Ghostbusters film. That's all I got for you today. Hope you guys enjoyed this review. Make sure you hit the like button, leave me a comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys next time. Later. I'm afraid of no ghost.